about that, but Lucas has locked himself up in that ranch. He doesn't go out into the real world. When he made even Star Wars films, he was living out in, he wasn't living in a ranch. He was out there in the real world, uh, uh, talking to people, uh, uh, reading on mythology. He was out there. Now he, for years, he locked himself up in a ranch, and all he cared about was special effects and things like that. He became sterile in his own storytelling. I'm only going to watch these comic book films, these heartfelt films that we grew up with, with directors that have balls, like Spielberg, Nolan. These guys have absolute control, or pretty much 95% control of their films. They're not going to be pushed into doing 3D, because 3D is the gimmick fab right now. If everything is becoming 3D, 3D is bullshit. I would like to see the Star Wars prequels redone. Uh, I wouldn't do... Star Wars prequels, anything like they were uh, uh, visually. Now I'm just talking visually, not even talking story-wise. Visually, I wouldn't want it to look like Avatar or the way it looked. It'd have to have a like a uh, like a District 9 feel to it, you know, very low. Keep it lower in budget. Keep it more real. You know, the only piece should be put very are like the lightsabers. Uh, they should be CGI'd, obviously, you know, uh, but keep everything set, keep it all in set, you know, and, 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 and locations like uh, Tunisia and uh, places like that, you know, keep it, keep it feeling real and organic. It's Star Wars, it's about exploring other universes and things like that, it's supposed to feel like that, and those films felt like they were just sterile, the whole thing. You know, I think, I think that's how Spielberg would have made, you know, I would love to see Spielberg re redo the whole thing. Because I think he would do it right. And so what we're seeing is projects that the studios are doing that it's, they're just getting a fall guy, pretty much. They're not getting respectable people that have balls, that have a vision, that want to follow through. So when I see a weak director, I'm just staying away. When I see guys that have control and are respected, those are the films that we have to go see.